Hello everyone and welcome back to a new video. In this video, I'm going to show you guys how you can disable personal vault in OneDrive. So if you guys want to learn how to do it, just follow the steps that I'm going to show you. As you can see guys, I am right now on my desktop and this is how the home page looks like. So right now, go ahead and open the file explorer. If you don't find this right here, just go to the start menu and then search for the file explorer. Once you find it, go ahead and click on open and then you're going to be right here in this window. Once you're here, just go to the left and then right here, you're going to find all of the sections. Here, you're going to find the home section, gallery, OneDrive and so on. So just go to OneDrive, right click on it and then right here, you're going to find all of these options. Here, you're going to find the option to copy it, expand it, open it in a new tab, open new window and so on. And here, you're going to find the option to always keep it on this device free up space and lastly here you're gonna find the OneDrive uh, section so click on OneDrive and then here you're gonna find the option to view it online settings and lastly here you're gonna find folder color so right now click on view online and then once you do that this will take you to this page on the web once you're here just go to the left right here you're gonna find all of the sections here you're gonna find my files recent photos shared and lastly the recycle bin make sure you're here in my files and then right here, as you can see, guys, you're going to find your personal vault. So right now, as you can see, guys, it's uh, already unlocked. So we're going to lock it. Just click on these three dots and then click on lock. And then as you can see, guys, right now it's locked. So right now, if you want to unlock it, just click right here, click on unlock. And then as you can see, guys, you need to verify your identity. So I'm going to choose the option to send a code to my email. And then you're going to receive the code on your email address. So all you need to do guys is uh, check the code and type it right here. And then once you type the code, just click on verify. And then you're going to be able to verify your identity. And as you can see guys, right now the personal vault is unlocked. Thank you guys for watching. See you guys in the next video.